guys, I'm Jeff the Homestead Dad. Welcome to the Homestead. Today is pig sorting day. So we have 12 pigs and we need to get six of them into that trailer right there. We've set up a temporary pen with some field fence and um, a couple cattle panels. So hopefully that works. And my brother-in-law brought his trailer over and he's, he built a ramp that goes you can see the ramp. I'll bring it over closer and show you. It goes right up into it. So, the plan, I think, is to bring some food over here. Probably put some food in the mud over here. Get them this direction. And then put a little bit over here as well. And as the correct pigs come to the gate, I'm just going to lean over the gate here. Open it for the pigs I want in here. And close it if it's a pig that I don't want in there. So that's the plan. And then once we get the six pigs into this temporary pen, then I can put some feed up in the trailer and get them into there. That's the plan. We'll see if it uh, works out that way. I don't. It's Monday. I don't have to have them there until Thursday. So I've got today and tomorrow, and if I really had to, Wednesday morning, not Thursday, Wednesday, I have to take them in. Um, so I've got that much time. It was starting to dry out over here. It rained all morning and most of last night. It's a muddy mess again, but getting six pigs out of here should help. I'm gonna bring over the rest of the wood chips as soon as I can get a bucket on the tractor and come over here, give them a dry spot. We'll see what we can do. But first, let's get these things sorted. sneak in I wasn't supposed to I'm trying to get that one over back close to the gate so I can kind of push it back through without letting the two others that's fine it's fine they're they're fine with going in the the uh, trailer which is good I just need to get that other one back out of here so it doesn't get in the trailer because I'm taking six not seven so uh, I'll let you know how it goes and make sure they don't push their way back through Okay, we've got all seven here. We need to get the ones we want in the trailer. That's what we're gonna try to do now. Don't pull on that thing. Okay. This is it right here. Yep. Okay, so that's the one we don't want. Exactly. Hey, pig. So here, let me do this. You're the lucky one. Fill up that with buckets. And then I'm going to start letting the ones in that we want in. Put it all the way up in the head of the trailer. What are you doing? No, just use the corn. I know. Okay, come on, hurry up. I'm getting the scoop. Come on, hurry up. No, just 
All the way over there. Just dump it over overhead where the door is. Quick, quick, quick. Dad! Daddy, run! Success! Yes. Got one pig that I gotta get back in there. I should be able to do that pretty easily with a, a bucket of corn. The rest of them are in there. We've got to latch the door. Josh, do you want to do that? Let's see if I can. Um, but we should be good. Now they're in here. We'll feed them and water them here today and tomorrow. Then we won't feed them when they go in on Wednesday. Perfect! So I'm gonna throw Josh under the bus a little bit. Um, I told him to throw a little bit at the top of the ramp and a bunch in there. He put a bunch at the top of the ramp, so now I've got to wait for this, this girl, come on, to finish eating before she's interested in this so I can get her back out of this pen. Come on, come on, pig. Come on, pig. So, it's taking a little bit longer than I'd hoped, but we'll get there. Just like that, with a little patience. All the pigs we want over there are over there. And all the pigs we want in there are in there. So, obviously, couldn't have done this without a trailer to put them in. So, thanks to my brother-in-law, Jason, who used to have a YouTube channel. It still has videos, but he doesn't do anything with it anymore. It's a 77 crossbar ranch. And crossbar is one word. Um, and then his, uh, his push board, which we used when we helped my buddy Frank get his pigs loaded up. Uh, it was ideal for stopping the ones we didn't want in and letting the ones in we did want in. So, yeah, perfect. So, in a couple days, we'll take them to the butcher, and then in a few couple weeks after that, we'll have pork. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you got any questions, let me know. I don't have a whole lot of answers, but I'll tell you what I know. So, God bless you and your family. I'll see you guys next video.